No, it, honestly, it's looking good. I mean, this okay. run of dry weather what we've had, we've had the clear skies, and I do think that uh, this is going to cooperate for us. I think we got a decent chance, and I'll show you why I think that on your hour by hour. We've got the clear skies now. Those stick around into tomorrow morning, and as we head into the evening, you can see a little bit of cloud cover trying to work its way in. Really just going to be passing clouds though until we head into the overnight. So if you want to sneak out uh, after sunset and check this out for a few hours even, I think you'll have a pretty decent chance at seeing some of those meteors fly through. And clouds do filter back in on Monday though, so dodging a little bit of a cloudy bullet here. You can see rain starting to work its way in finally though. It is going to be very moisture strapped. We're not talking about a significant amount of rain with this, though it is nice to finally see some green on the radar again. You can see that area of rain shifts out of here. Much of the day on Tuesday is looking quiet besides that morning chance for a few showers. And by a few showers again, it is going to be relatively light. Could see as much as maybe four tenths of an inch down towards Ottumwa. Lamoni right around that same number, but you get much north of there and those numbers drop off dramatically. So don't expect a lot. And really this is going to be hitting areas where we don't even have that burn ban in place with the most rain. So you look north of there and it has been bone dry for a very long time. Still 61 burn bans across the state. And I don't see really much help in the near term here for this. So if uh, you do have plans to maybe have a bonfire, maybe rethink that as those burn bands will likely continue to be in place for a while. We are warming up. That's only going to exacerbate that. We have got sunny skies along with that as temperatures climb into the low 80s tomorrow and checking out the next eight days. There's that chance for a shower or two as those uh, make their way on through into Tuesday. Got Highland uh, happening vintage market going on tomorrow. We'll step off for a second so you can see it. It's looking like weather's going to be perfect. Middle 60s is that starts and we'll see that temperature climb back to 80 degrees. It is going to that breeze is going to pick up a little bit in the afternoon, but uh, go get those vintage clothes. They're uh, they're pretty cool stuff and looks like a pretty big event. 53 is what we're dropping to tonight. Still staying above average again tomorrow. We're back up into the low to mid 80s. We keep that forecast on Monday and that system that moves through. We're much cooler behind that temperatures dropping back into the middle 60s, but short lived cool down yet again, even though we're waking up to some uh, really uh, cold temperatures Thursday morning at 38 back to 73 by next weekend.